Yeah. This is a grounding technique from Atlantis. What you've got to do is close your eyes and like meditate. But what you do is you visualize a halo around your head. It's about this big. It is in white light, angelic white light. And what happens is it goes two, uh, two inches down, one inch up, two inches down, one inches up. And it's checking you out. It can get rid of that. Uh, uh, you got to do is by intent program it to check you out. And it might change colour. You might see different colours. If it's red, it means there's attachment. It can also do green for healing. So what you got to do is just close your eyes and uh, imagine this halo above your head. And it goes to the ground. And when it goes to the ground, send in moonlight to clear, to clear the negativity of your body. So just close your eyes. You can see the halo above your head. It's bright white angelic light shining on you. It's now going down. It's checking your body. It's going down. It might change color. You're not programming. It programs itself. It's now at your. Uh, uh, it's now going past your head. Now, now don't do going past your purple chakra. It's now going to your throat chakra, and it's going two up, two down. You might feel very warm. Uh, it's fine. It's going all the way down to your chest. Uh, it keeps on going two inches, one, one inch down. Two inches down, one inch up, two inch down. So it's cleansing. It's, it's giving you the ingredients to fix your body if you need fixing. It's clearing any attachments, any entities, any negative uh, uh, parts that are still in your aura field. It's now going to your root chakra, two inches up, one inch down. It goes past your legs. It's got, it keeps on going two inches, one inch down. You can actually see it in your in your uh, in your mind's eye. It's now going to your knees. It keeps on going two inches, one inch down. Uh, two inches down, one inch up. And then it goes to your feet. When it goes to your feet, you then send moon energy into your crown chakra into your crown thing and it, that pushes everything right down to the halo. Then it starts all the negativity of going to your, uh, going to the earth, going to the earth. And just one, what I normally do is send the halo back up to your head and then right down again so it pushes everything down and cleanses you. And you can do a prayer if that's your belief. And uh, that's it. and then you can wake up. Oh, is that okay? Did anyone feel anything there? Yeah. Yes, uh, the feeling of wooziness heading to another dimensional plane and uh, the colors were changing as you were going. So it started out yellow, then green, then uh, bright magenta, and then it changed to, as you were kind of toward the hip stomach area, kind of a reddish, and then it quick changed to bright yellow and green, and then down toward the, from the rest of the way down for the legs, it was all uh, violet, uh, violet purple. So yeah, lots of different activations and clearing going on apparently. <laughs> you, you can get downloads for this as well. You actually can get downloads just by doing this, which is quite a bit strange. That's good. Anybody else see anything? I had this little black thing in the middle of my back. Wonder. Interesting. Mm. I took it. You moved it. And then I had, my head was blue. I whole head aura was blue. I don't know what that meant. Mm. Blue. Yeah. Blue, that's like angelic. You've got me on that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the aura. Yeah, the whole, my whole head was blue, and then my whole back, all down my back, around that little black back thing, whatever was removed in the middle of my back, was green energy, and all down into my up, up down into my legs. The rest, of, the rest of the way down was all white. Hmm. Hey, I, I, you don't mind me telling a story about the halo? I've been using this for about 10, 15 years. And I, I only thought it was white light, but an healer was healing me that had a demonic entity on it. 
And I ended up getting loads and loads of attachments from this uh, entity. And when I did it, I thought, why has it gone all red? <laughs> I was panicked and it was actually removing, it was burning them out. It was actually burning, uh, it all in the aura field and it was burning them out. So I only thought it did white. But now I've been told it, the colour is the colour you need. But you need some blue guys. Right? I had a first colour cake. They're really bright orange. <laughs> Right, I think I'm bright orange like emotion, but bright orange. It's helping your emotions. That near your head part, yeah. Huh? Yeah. Is that where was it? Was it where your head is? Um it was a little bit lower, maybe the chest area. Yeah, it might be yeah, your heart chakra. Just needed a bit of fixing a little bit. Yeah. Everywhere I didn't think of colours for anywhere else, I just kept visualizing the plate where now and then up now and up. It felt really peaceful as well. It felt like all my glass. Yeah. 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 I'd recommend that every day, especially if you do a lot of healing and a lot of spiritual work. Yeah, I'll do it at night just before you go to bed. Sounds good. You pick anything up in a day, you can clear it out. The sacral chakra is related to orange as well. I know. I was going to say that I actually felt um, that it was going to cleanse Dave's. Uh, issue that you were just talking about I don't, it, during that time I mean I felt just bright white light and it got grew more intense but I felt a lot of heat and then as it went down through my body I can actually I don't know why his issue connected into my image but I felt it healing his problem that he was talking about and it's odd that you did say about the sacral or the orange because it is sacral and that's kind of in that area that'll help cleanse and push that out He's working on filling his sacral chart with white magic. So that might be, you know, helping him clear things, clear blockages in that area, too. Yeah, it, it works as an healing as well as a grounding. But it's got like a double, uh, double whammy. It, it can do either. Or it can do both, actually. Yeah, that's good. Well, I felt the, the cleansing and all the wonderful colours, but right at the very end, I felt my penile gland um, vibrating. So I don't know if I've put, um, cleared something there or is that unusual? I'd say, I'd say that's a great, that could be a download. <laughs> it might okay. be a download, download okay. breaking, especially where it is, especially with yeah. the position. It was like it, it only came when I'd done that clearing. Yeah. So that was when the when the halo was complete, that's when I felt that jolt was there. I thought, oh, okay. Mm. Okay, thank you. Thank you.